I'm Bill Bro. This is Kidney Cancer News, and today we'll be talking about how cancer advocates are reacting to proposed funding cuts that will affect cancer research. And we'll also briefly describe a clinical trial. The agent being studied is MDX1106. And later this week, we'll provide you with information concerning how you can consider participating in this and other clinical research projects. Let's get started. Cancer research advocates are preparing for cuts after years of funding increases. According to an article by Carrie Young reporting in Congressional Quarterly, advocates for cancer research are bracing for a lean year on the government funding front as conservative lawmakers push for deep spending cuts. House Republican appropriators are looking to slice about $6 billion out of the labor HHS spending bill. That carries the money for research through the National Institutes of Health and the National Cancer Institute. Getting the Senate to agree with House leaders on the reductions is another matter. Cancer research advocate Tom Harkin, an Iowa Democrat and chairman of the Senate Labor HHS Education Appropriations Subcommittee, is expected to fiercely defend the funding. In other news, a Phase 1B study of MDX-1106 in patients with advanced or recurrent malignancies is described in detail on the clinicaltrials.gov website. The purpose of the study is to determine the safety and effectiveness of MDX-1106 in patients with certain types of cancer, and that includes kidney cancer. Another purpose is to determine how MDX-1106 is absorbed and distributed within the body and how it's eventually eliminated. If you'd like more information about this clinical trial, you'll find it featured on our Facebook fan page and also on our Clinical Trials Facebook page. To get that information, simply visit our homepage at kidneycancer.org. I'm Bill Bro, wishing you good health. Thank you.